Mental math tricks for addition, rounding, then subtracting to find a sum. Mental math is math we calculate in our head without pencil and paper. One method to add quickly is to round the numbers up to easy and compatible numbers, then take away the excess. It's easy to add 100 plus 100 without pencil and paper as 200. It's just as easy to add 99 plus 98 by rounding both add-ins up to 100, then subtracting the excess amount. We think to ourselves, 99 is 1 less than 100, 98 is 2 less than 100, their sum is 3 less than 200. We think of 99 as 100, we think of 98 as 100, that's 200 added together. Now we need to take away the 3 that it was rounded up to. And 200 minus 3 is equal to 197, so that means 99 plus 98 is equal to 197. Sometimes it's faster or easier to round all of the add-ends. Sometimes it's faster or easier to round one add-end. If we need to add 19 plus 19 plus 19, we can round each of those add-ends up to 20 and think in our head 20 plus 20 plus 20, but now we have to subtract 3 because these are each 1 less than 20, so we would have 1, 2, 3 that we would need to take away from 60. 20 plus 20 plus 20 is equal to 60. We take away the 3 excess, extra, and we know that it's equal to 57. To add 195 plus 99, we round the add-ends up to 200 plus 100 which is equal to 300. We think in our head, 195 is 5 less than 200, and 99 is 1 less than 100. Their sum is 6 less than 300. When we rounded them up, we got 300. Now we need to take away that 6 extra, because it's 6 less. We think 300 minus 6 is equal to 294. So, 195 plus 99 is equal to 294. And we can do it even easier. We can think of that 6 as taking away the 5 and then taking away a 1. 300 minus 5 would be 295. Take away one more, and it's 294. We can also round one add end. Like, we can round the 99 to 100 and leave the 195 alone. We think 195 plus 100. Now, because we rounded this up one more to make it a 100, we need to take that one away. We think 195 plus 100 is 295. Now we'll take that one away. It's 294. We can use this method to quickly add while shopping. A shirt costs $19.99, and a pair of pants costs $39.99. We mentally round them to $20 and $40. $20 plus $40 is equal to $60. $19.99 is one cent less than $20. $39.99 is one cent less than $40. Their sum is two cents less than than $60. The sum must be $59.98. We can mentally add 28 plus 29 by rounding both add-ins up to 30. We think 30 plus 30 is equal to 60. 28 is 2 less than 30. 29 is 1 less than 30, so 28 plus 29 must be 3 less than 60. And 60 minus 3 is 57, therefore 28 plus 29 is equal to 57. 
for 497 plus 29. We round both add ends and we think 500 plus 30. And then we need to take away 4 because 497 is 3 away from 500 and 29 is 1 away from 30. 497 plus 29 is equal to 526. For 58 plus 15, we round one add end. We think 60 plus 15. And since 58 is 2 less than 60, we're going to need to remove 2 from its sum. 60 plus 15 is 75. We take away the 2, it's 73. Therefore, 58 plus 15 is equal to 73. Sometimes it's faster or easier to round all of the add ends. Sometimes it's faster or easier to round one add end. For 359 plus 19, we can round both to the nearest 10 as 360 plus 20, which is equal to 380. 359 is 1 less than 360, and 19 is 1 less than 20, so their sum must be 2 less than 380. 380 minus 2 is equal to 378, so 359 plus 19 is equal to 378. For 9 plus 9, we think 10 plus 10 minus 2. 20 minus 2 is equal to 18, therefore 9 plus 9 is equal to 18. We know 9 is 1 less than 10, and we add them as 10 plus 10 and take away the 2 excess. Using mental math to calculate is faster than using a calculator, and you can try this with someone. You can add 195 plus 195 as 200 plus 200 minus 10. This is 5 less than 200, and this is 5 less than 200. So we add them as 200 plus 200 in our head and take away the 10 excess. That means it's equal to 400 minus 10. It's equal to 390. By the time someone turns the calculator on and clears out any calculations from before, then keying in each number and hitting the equal sign, you could already have the answer in your head. Our next lesson is Mental Math Tricks for Addition, Compensation Method to Add. As always, I hope you have a wonderful day, and I hope you join me for the next lesson. Bye!